Okay, uh, here we are getting set up for another shot. And this shot is of uh, Juliet with Swami Kriyananda. And they'll be having tea down here in Swami's lower garden. And you can see there's quite a bit of equipment. There's a big reflector overhead to reflect light down. And then uh, other lights to uh, reflect in. And there'll be two camera, two cameras set up. And uh, I'll keep you up to date as uh, we prog progress with this uh, scene shot. There we are, further along. In the setup, or this is the final setup. Uh, Juliet is sitting there, Swami Kriyananda and David Eby having tea, and it's just amazing the amount of equipment <laughs> and lights that are being used right here. But uh, I'll go ahead and when they start filming rehearsals, I'll come back to you. Are you, can you hear her okay when she speaks in, a, in her normal tone of voice or should we to talk louder? So maybe okay. we should, uh, maybe you should say, could you, you know, you'll have to speak up a little bit because I, my Yes, would you like me to talk as loudly? <laughs> <Yeah>, please. <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm, so the, the points we're covering here are these, the, her initial reactions, your, uh, uh, what was the inspiration to, to, to found Ananda to begin with, and then, uh, which gets us to uh, the, dinner, the garden party, you know? Do you think that maybe four or five minutes might be enough time to do all of that? No? Let it go. Let's go. Let's just go Let's and we'll see. Shoot. Where's Dariani going to sit? She will be sitting uh, Grips. Uh, over here, okay. but not in this moment. Grips. Because the cam we're only shooting now here like this up to here. Yeah, and the same thing, so a slow, slow creep in on yeah. her and on you just to get her natural reaction. Be sure to get my ear. Your ear? Absolutely. Yes, we, we're going to do big close-ups. Yes. <laughs> okay, here we go. Starting at the beginning. Okay. We're at the beginning. What? We're at, at her. Do you mind if I record this? This is the first day And so you've already again. greeted her, and now you're just oh, waiting another for Another scene with uh, Julia uh, off meeting with uh, Swamiji having tea. We're only doing close-ups right now. And here we go. So, and action. Do you mind if I record this? Not at all. So I just wanted to spend a little time talking to you about the community today and get your opinion on what's happening in the world. What are the greatest conflicts that we're facing now in society? You know, we can talk about conflicts, but I think what people really, everybody really wants is happiness. And you can talk about happiness until you're blue in the face. But if you can provide the world with examples of where people live in harmony and happiness, and think not of greed, not of what I can get, but what I can give. You talked about lack of ego and community. I just want to have a better understanding of what your motivation is in this life. You have, I have to say this, that I've had one motivation in life. And that is to serve my guru, to help to make his message known in the world. Not for his sake, but for the world's sake. I feel that what he brought to the world is something very desperately needed. So everything I do has that motivation behind it.